Greetings, and welcome back to Here's What I Heard. I'm Laura Degatis, your hostess. Thank you for clicking on my little acre of the internet today. This week, I would like to read you some lyrics from a song that was written in 1981 by Frank Zappa. He was a muse of mine since I can remember. Nine, ten years old, I've always listened to his music. As I grew up, I noticed and found out that he was a true proponent of our Constitution and a very big advocate for the freedom of speech, especially, and, of course, the Ten Amendments. He even went to Congress to, to fight for the rights of all artists with regards to censorship. So, it's kind of a no-brainer when I, when I actually do things and highlight Frank Zappa and people like him, because I'm the same kind of advocate for the freedom of speech. The reason that I chose this song is because of the fact that I see a lot of things in it as I read it that are actually happening and have happened and do happen still today and are very relevant today. So I hope that my interpretation of this song, of these song lyrics, at least entertain you and maybe make you think, hey, this guy was ahead of his time. I always thought so, especially when it came to some of his music. So. I give you today, Dumb All Over. Dumb All Over. Whoever we are, wherever we're from, we should have noticed by now. <coughs> our behavior is dumb. And if our chances expect to improve, it's going to take a lot more than trying to remove the other race or the other whatever. From the face of the planet, all together. They call it the Earth, which is a dumb kind of name. But they named it right, because we behave the same. We are dumb all over. Dumb all over. Yes, we are. Dumb all over near and far, dumb all over, black and white, people, we is not wrapped tight. Hi. Hey, who's the president? Byron. Who's the president? Byron. Look out, 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 look out. Nerds on the left, nerds on the right. Religious fanatics on the air every night. The sharing of biased and false, false news has become all too common on social media. media. More on these zombies have been all these things, they've been all these things, they've been all these things, makes the details sound real gory about what to do if the geeks over there don't believe in the book we got over here. You can't run a race without no feet and pretty soon, there won't be no street for dummies to jog on. Or doggies to dog on. No, come on. Let's go. Let's go. Hey. Hey. Hey, go. Come on. Religious fanatics can make it be all gone. I mean, it won't blow up or disappear. It'll just look ugly for a thousand years.
You can't run a country by a book of religion, not by a heap or a lump or a smidgen of foolish rules of ancient date designed to make you all feel great. While you fold, spindle, and mutilate those unbelievers from the neighboring state. Two arms, two arms, hooray! That's great! Two legs ain't bad, unless there's a crate they ship the parts to mama in. For souvenirs, two ears, get down. Not his, not hers, but what the hey? The good book says it's got to be that way, but their book says... Revenge the Crusades. With whips and chains and hand grenades. Two arms, two arms, have another and another. Our God says there ain't no other. Our God says it's all okay. Our God says this is the way. It says in the book, burn and destroy. Repent and redeem. Revenge and deploy. Rumble thee forth to the land of the unbelieving scum of the other side because they don't go for what's in the book, and that makes them bad. So verily we must chop it them up and stomp it them down, or run a nice French bomb to poof them out of existence while leaving their real estate just where we need it. To use again for temples in which to praise our God, because he can really take care of business. And when his humble TV servant with humble white hair and humble glasses and a nice brown suit and maybe a blonde wife who takes phone calls tells us our God says it's okay to do this stuff then we gotta do it cause if we don't do it we ain't going up to heaven depending on which book you're using at the time can't use theirs it don't work it's all lies gotta use mine ain't that right that's what they say every night every day hey we can't really be dumb if we're just following god's orders hey let's get serious god knows what he's doing he wrote this book here and the book says he made us all to be just like him so if we're dumb then god is dumb and maybe even a little bit ugly on the side these nuts <laughs> Got I do hope you enjoyed my video today. Don't forget, Thursday, 7 p.m. Central Time, 5 p.m. Avocado Time, Talk To Me America series where you call in and tell the world what you heard. The world wants to know what you have to say, so call me and tell them like it is. Also, don't forget a subscription, a comment, a like, a subscribe, a share, and of course, a donation would be the ultimate. All of my links are down below, so please click on some of them, will ya? Thank you for clicking on my little acre of the internet today. Until next time!